In this video, I'm going to do uh, one very uh, simple example of coordinate geometry. So the question is, find the equation of a line parallel to y is equal to 3x minus 1 that passes through the point P4, negative 2. So I've drawn a, so this is your x-axis and this is your y-axis. Now this line y is equal to 3x minus 1, minus 1 is your y-intercept, so this is your y-intercept, negative 1. And you you have a gradient or a slope of 3. So I plotted this point. Uh, the, how did I get this point? Pl uh, the slope of 3 means from this point of negative 1, you go 3 up. The top number tells you the rise, and the bottom number tells you the run. So this you rise 3, 1, 2, 3, and then you run 1. So this is this point. So this line is the line y is equal to 3x minus 1. And you want to find a line which is parallel to this. So and passing through 4, negative 2. So this is 1, 2, 3, 4, and this is negative 2. So this point is 4, negative 2. So I've drawn a line which is passing through this line, and we want to find what's the equation of this line. So the equation is basically, what is the equation of this line? Okay. Now, what is the mean information? The gradient of this line is 3, so the gradient of this line has to be 3 because they are parallel, so they have the same slope or the same gradient. So let us uh, name this. So this is my L1 and this is my L2. So equation of, so this is what we want to find, equation of L2. So we know that the gradient is how much? If two lines are parallel, they have to have the same gradient or the slope. So the gradient is 3. So the equation has to be y is equal to 3x plus c, where c is the y-intercept. Now what do we know about one point? We need only one point to get the c. So we know that this line L2 is passing through 4, negative 2. So we can say 4, negative 2 is on this line. Okay, so we can say when x is 4, y is negative 2. So let us put that back into the equation. When x is 4, y is negative 2. So I can say in place of y, I can put negative 2. So you go negative 2 is equal to 3 times 4 plus c. Now you have to simplify this to get to c. So minus 2 is equal to 12 plus c. Okay, now I want to get c, so I want to eliminate this 12. So to eliminate this 12, I have to take away 12 from this side. So I have to take away 12 from this side. So this and this gets cancelled. So this is negative 14 is equal to c. Okay, so equation of L2 is y is equal to 3x minus 14. Now, to check this answer, get your calculators out. If you have a graphic calculator, go to your graph and type in this equation. The first equation was 3x minus 1, and the second equation is 3x minus 14. And make the scale a bit bigger, say standard scale would do, and then draw it. Can you see these two lines? This is y is equal to 3x minus 1. And this is equal to y is equal to 3x minus 14. And you can see that the lines are parallel. See you in the next video.